Welcome to the third tutorial in our series related to using earned value analysis in Primavera P6. These tutorials are intended to provide an introduction to earned value management in P6. In previous lessons, we calculated earned value and planned value, so let's just do a quick review of some terms. Schedule percent complete reflects how much of our schedule has been consumed as of the data date. It is used in the calculation of planned value. Planned value tells us this is the dollar amount we should have earned as of this point in time. In this instance, it's $4,000. Performance percent complete is what has actually been accomplished when we status our schedule. It is used in the calculation of earned value. In this instance, we've earned $2,000. One quick way to see how your schedule is performing is just to compare the two percentages. In this instance, I can see I should be 50% of the way through the schedule, but I'm only 25% of the way. I can also see that if I am, uh, at this point in time, I should have earned $4,000, but I've only earned $2,000. So just by quickly looking at those values, I can see that I'm behind schedule. Another way to interpret that is to use the Schedule Performance Index. The Schedule Performance Index is calculated by dividing my earned value over my planned value. So in this instance, it's $2,000 divided by $4,000 arriving at an index of 0.5. If the index is less than 1, it indicates that less work was actually performed than was scheduled at this point in time. Another way to look at it is that for every dollar of physical work this project had planned to accomplish, only 50 cents was actually done. Let's talk about interpreting the cost performance information. So far in this project we've incurred an actual cost of $3,000, but we've only earned $2,000. We should have earned $4,000. So I can quickly tell by looking at these values that I'm probably over budget. I can also use the cost performance index also known as CPI. This is calculated by dividing earned value cost over actual cost. Again, a value of less than one indicates that my actual costs have exceeded what I've earned. Another way to interpret this CPI is that for every dollar I spent, I only actually accomplished 67 cents worth of work. Again, the purpose of this tutorial was to help you interpret your earned value results and specifically using the CPI, which is the Cost Performance Index, and the Schedule Performance Index. I hope this information is useful to you.